What up everybody, Josiah Music, aka Producing Noob. Today we are going to be finishing up our review for AOA Music Library's sample packs. And to be honest, I wouldn't even say finishing up. I'm probably going to continue to review them as more come out and I caught more stuff. They blessed me with one called Isolation, so I'm going to show you majority stuff from that. But I'm also going to work on stuff with what I already had before and let's just get into it. Sorry about that. All right, so starting off, we're gonna listen to Kayla's intro. Hello, Jesus. Hello, Jesus. Hello, Jesus. That's hard. We're gonna listen to Lavender now. Crazy bass. Quality of these samples is superb. Okay, so my microphone was going on. Okay, that's why. <laughs> All right, next one. Shortest one within the pack. Still hard. If it sounds like I'm skipping through these, it's because I really want to just um get to the breakdown as soon as possible and really show you how creative you can get with these. That pause in the beginning is hard. with that one horns I don't want to show you that one because that's gonna be a part of a beat that I display for you guys That's definitely like Travis Scotty type stuff. Trap soul vibes here. guitar stuff you could definitely do something with that one yo this one's crazy i listened to the majority of these ahead of time but this one's crazy i really like this one I want to make a beat with this one like right now. I'm probably going to add to this video and just make a beat live at the end because this is crazy. And we're back. So this is the OG sample for Roses with nothing edited.
is hard. Just a little slow. And so what I did was I just sped it up and pitched it. And I'm gonna show you that now. So this is the version I ended up with. It's harder. <laughs> the samples are already hard though. Like this beat took like five minutes. It wasn't much because the sample was just so good and it gave me great inspiration. This is the percussion. Just your basic kick, snare, hat, open hat. Don't need a lot for this one. Got a chain rattling. And slowed down version of Pac-Man dying. As far as counter melodies go, I came up with this. All counter melodies are brought to you by Virtual Power. Best VST out right now. I'm giving away a copy and I'll tell you how to do that later on. This is the other counter melody. That's the love filter. There's also a bass. So the bass I made in Virtual Power is right here. That love feels would go hard. All right. And then last thing is this transition right here. And that leads to a supply, surprise coming up. Wait, switch And you'll see what that leads into. All right, this is it completed.
dope. I'm going to see you guys on the next one. We're moving to the next beat. All right, we're back for this next one. It's a little simpler. And but what I mean by that is I did less to it. The sample was so great that I didn't really feel like it needed much to be honest. So as far as like percussion and stuff, I added this that I got from Unison. It's just noise. Oopsies. Then I got this. This is also from Unison. It's um it's like this rocks thing I found. This is the OG version, right? Here. Like before I made it unique, it was like this originally. But I just time stretched it and pitched it. And so now it sounds like this. I also mess with the volume. I got this in here just for the snare. I just really felt like the snare matched for the beat. I chopped it up a little bit because I didn't like how the original snare pattern was. I had some crazy little hi-hats. Not too crazy. Had this evil laugh. You get the point. And then a kick. simple kick all right oh i got this 808 hidden that go hard this is the sample This was the original. So before I did anything to it, it sounded like this. It's dope, but it was a little slow. So I basically sped it up. Mm, that's hard though. Like you can't tell me that's not fire. And AOA is known for their fire samples, guys. Like. I know I'm not getting paid to do these videos. I'm just doing it out of love because I feel like they deserve a lot of credit, you know. And they give free stuff too. Like you don't have to pay money for good samples. They have sample packs that you can pay for. You know, I would say buy the paid ones too just to show support and appreciation. But they post a lot of good free content on their YouTube channel too. And it's royalty free. Anyways, this is what I did to the sample. Just sped it and pitched it. It chopped right here. Chop screw. Boom. Okay. So all together, this is what we got. Oh, and I got virtual power. Hang on. Just wanted like a guitar in there. Get you that virtual power, y'all. It changes lives. All right.
that's it for this one. I'm gonna cut to the last beat. I made, I showed you two that I made with isolation. I'm gonna show you one I made with one of the other samples. And then what up, y'all? Okay, so for this one, I didn't even tweak the sample. The sample was really nice and peaceful, and I just wanted to leave it as is. So this is from the Western pack. Great guitar, just real nice. And like I said, I didn't even really do anything to it. I just cloned it one time. And with the clone, it's just a lower octave and lower volume with faded stereo. Next percussion was pretty simple. We just got this. <laughs> Then snare comes around here. Just simple. This beat is still like in beta. It's nowhere near completion. I just wanted to show you like another example of what you could do with these awesome samples before I ended it. Cause last time we only went over two beats. We didn't get to go over three. Counter melodies, virtual power, of course. That's the secret sauce. You need to get you some of that. And I use elevator music. It's a it's under the keys section. Also, I had scalar, but I only did it because I like the horns in this case. Like this is from the brass ensemble little preset thing under orchestra and scalar. And I just did this with the brass. And yeah, this is the whole thing. I might um start posting my beats, by the way. Like the beats from my videos, I might start, you know, mixing them and then posting them on YouTube under a separate page for you guys to listen to them if you just like how they sound. Like this one, I'm gonna finish and post it. But this is the finished one for the drive. So for the third video in a row, well not in a row, but this is my third AOA music library video. And what you should get from all these is stop sleeping on my boys at AOA music library because they're lit, they have great paid stuff, and they have great free stuff. If you don't know what their free stuff sounds like, I'm gonna link their YouTube down below. Or you could check out my first video I did on them where I made beats using they're free stuff and I promise you bro you won't be disappointed other stuff to say I'm gonna be giving away a free copy of the virtual power VST as well as discount codes and a special sample pack for AOA music library and I'm also giving away $250 it's gonna be for a sampling contest using AOA music libraries samples and one of the virtual wave plugins if you don't have virtual power it's okay you don't have to pay money to enter technically you could use their virtual daydreams or their virtual vintage plugin and same thing with aoa music library if you can't afford any of their sample packs if you go to their youtube they have tons of free samples that you can use to enter the competition you don't have to pay money at all to enter this you just sample 
all right that'll do it for this one everybody have a blessed day